In this clip, we're going to take a look at the adapters that we're going to carry. Uh, similar to all other hose adapters, there's a male and a female part to it. Uh, and this is going to allow us to hook the suction hose to different fittings. One would be a dry hydrant, other would be suction strainers, and of course to the side of the pump panel. So let's start with this one. Uh, this adapter right here allows uh, for a threaded NST male, 6 inch NST male that we would find on many of our dry hydrants to be connected to the male uh, of the cam lock. So to make that work, we have a female cam lock, 6 inch, and we have a female 6 inch NST. This takes the place of that double swiveling uh, female that we've carried from threaded hose that often can be problematic. So this would be the fitting that you're going to use on the dry hydrant. Again, you simply are going to take it and connect it up using the ears and get that in place and you'll see how we do that when we show the video of hooking up to the dry hydrant. The other adapter we have here for the male end is going to allow the male end of the cam lock, male coming in, to be converted to a male end of NST. Where you'll see this, uh, this will be on our strainers. One will be pre-connected in the low level strainer since that's the one we're most likely to draft from in a port -a tank operation. So again, this is gonna be used for connecting the male end of the cam lock suction hose to any type of suction strainer that we have, barrel strainer, floating strainer, or the low level strainer.